Bonjour, mon ami. Bonjour. This Bonjour. Is, this is the closest that I could come to becoming a detective for today's stream. How do I explain Magpie Murders without giving you a spoiler? Oh, I, I just, I, how do I, exp I can't, I, I don't know how to just like, I wanted to talk about Magpie Murders. Magpie yes. murders. murders. Not THE Magpie Murders. Magpie, Magpie murders. murders. It is a book by Anthony Horowitz and there is a show about it the mac uh, magpie murder show which is there right now on sony live india you can watch all the episodes it's six episodes only now why are we talking about this okay i read the book okay rohan saw the show yes and how do i explain magpie murders without giving you a spoiler but i'll explain very simple plot there is an author called alan conway alan conway writes murder mysteries his character is called atticus punt I love that name though. I love Atticus Pund is a great Atticus name. Atticus Pund is such and with the two little dots. With the little the, yeah. Oh Pund. my god. Oh my god. It's very simple. Someone gets murdered in a tiny village. Atticus Pund goes to investigate. Exact, exact Agatha Christie. In fact, yeah. uh, in it's the basically, book. Basically, it's not closed room murder mystery, but it's like hermetically sealed environment, like closed village. Yeah murder mystery in a way where like, everyone knows everyone everyone knows everyone yeah everyone had a motive he based a character on you the dim detective you stay out of my way unmarried unloved yes yes i'm on my own but that didn't give him the right to turn me into some sort of grotesque loser he played games designed to hurt people he told me he was going to base a character on me. Yes, he made you the doctor. Am I the killer? If someone really did push him off that tower, there'd have been plenty of volunteers. Someone gets murdered, okay? Her name is Mary Blakiston. She is a maid and she gets murdered. And that is that is the plot. And everyone wants to find out how she was murdered, who murdered her whatsoever. And Atticus Poon naturally lands up at the scene. Atticus Poon, his assistant is James Fraser. Because you need to have an assistant. You need to have an assistant. An yeah. assistant asks dumb questions because of you course. need a detective. Ka, so what do you think? Aapko kaise lagta hai? And he's like, well, let me tell you, Bunty. <laughs> he's like, no, sir, James, James, sir, James. James, uh, James, but Bunty. Yes, I, sorry, Bunty. Yes, I'm James Fraser, the thick assistant. Well, then do tell me, I want to know. In the process, in the process of explaining everything, he is just about to explain. And literally at that last point, the chapters just are blank. And then we switch to modern day. Uh, so Atticus Punka's story would be what, like some 1900s? Maybe? 58, 58, 58, 58, 58, 50s, yeah, 50s. 50s. So it's very old school. And then suddenly we switch to modern day England and Susan Ryland who's the editor. She's like, yo, where are the last pages? And her editor's like, yo, I don't know. And she's like, ah? <laughs> what? Bloody manuscript. There's no last chapter. A who done it without the solution. It's not even worth the paper. It won't be printed on. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Okay, we need to talk to Alan. But the best part is, they find out Alan also has is dead, and apparently it is a murder. Although yep. they say it is a suicide, and she goes to find out. So it is a murder mystery in a murder mystery, and and she also tries to solve the mystery. Right? Can you deduct who has murdered Alan Conway, and who has murdered Mary Blakiston in both parallel stories? And I'll tell you why I'm asking you this question. I read the book. I was very happy. There was a moment where I went, yes, I think I know it. You know that that Batti Jalna Wala moment? And then in the end, the reveal happened. I felt really upset. I, I felt thoroughly upset that I didn't get it. Because it is so obvious. It is so in your face. It is such a minute in your face detail. But when you see that detail, na, you slap yourself. You're like, why didn't it? It's so... Yeah. Such yeah. Such a tiny detail. Absolutely. Absolutely. British mysteries, man. Yeah. They're just great. They're just... And it's just great. British mysteries are just great. I don't know why, but they just are. Same thing, now Because you've got a mansion. You've got your old school huh. people. You've got a vicar. The fun part of quizzing. The fun part of crosswords. The fun part of everything, right? It's all about deduction. It's all yeah. about how yeah. do you deduce your clues yep. to lead you yep. to your final thing. Every clue is laid out in a certain way and in mysteries though it's like it's very it's the pattern right if you yeah. find the pattern if you find the timing of what happened when how why it all falls into place correct what did you think of Atticus Punt as a as a detective I thought you were damn cool yeah, I love his like super you're very sweet chill demeanor. like he's very chill very sweet and not even like in that Sherlocky way he was just very chill yeah 
analyze. It'll come to you. Yeah. Like just there's something very sad about him. Yeah, it is. It is. There's One something of, he's got like this very like air of melancholy. His about eyes him. were so deep. Yeah. Like he had he had seen life. You know the guy yeah. who's played him. I'm like, this, yeah. is this a real guy? Is he like why is he so yeah. he's so yeah. mellow? Yeah. No, it could be something. Yeah. I I think I know who the I think I know who the. A couple of beautiful lines he has also. No, there's that yeah. one beautiful which is oh, but nothing is more personal than murder. Oh oh yeah yeah. What oh, a great yeah. line. Oh, what yeah. a great line. Yeah. Which is like somebody not telling him something because they say it's personal, and he's like, but nothing is more personal than murder. I have to tell you one of the most fun things that I've had watching the show and reading the book. So now when you read the book, right? Like we mentioned, there are parallel murder stories. Susan is exploring her angle. and atticus is exploring his angle when they did the show they did something really interesting they put the emphasis on susan they told you more about her life they explained certain things there are parts of the show that are not in the book they have mm-hmm. taken different liberties with it but susan and atticus were actually two separate angles that's it it was two stories you read and that's it yeah. and may result aa jata hai what i really like about the show is they meet yeah Yeah. Right? Like there yeah. are these moments where Susan is trying to solve something and there is a shadow and she looks up and Atticus Basically all conversations with her subconscious turn into conversations with Atticus. Which is so nice. Which is beautiful. It yeah. It is so nice and It's I It's a really laughed. lovely touch. I laughed so hard. There's this point where she is driving a car with Oh, that was very funny. Yeah. <laughs> that was very funny. <laughs> he is she saying something out of the car. Yeah, he is saying he something. <laughs> It could be your family, and she just kicks him out. Like, and- get out! Get out! I don't want to listen to your sh. Get out! I think I want to do that, dude. I want to. If I could kick my subconscious out, I would gladly kick him out of the car, dude. I would gladly yeah, kick yeah, him yeah. out of the car. Hundred percent, hundred percent. But then I'm an anxious, guilty guy, so I would go two hours later and pick him up again. <laughs> <laughs> I thought about. It. I saw that scene. I was like, hmm, I'd go back two hours later. I know me. I would go back like sorry come get you ice cream <laughs> yeah 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 I just it's okay come back at attic is come back yeah, you're absolutely back. fine dude just it's come okay back. don't be so sad buddy i know your eyes are sad you've seen stuff but yeah. don't be sad also uh, this is a genuine challenge to anyone who is watching if you can get who it is by That's okay yeah fine that's my challenge uh, i'll say this always but you never do like people don't get it people didn't message me if And this is my challenge, okay? If I don't know how to prove it, though, but if by any chance you know who the character is, like who has killed both murders, if you solve it before the sixth episode, you will be Mafatlal of the month. Hundred percent. I think we've discussed everything. I would love to give you spoilers for the show, but I don't want to. I really want people to enjoy this. Uh, if you want to read the book, please do read the book. You will enjoy the show even more. If you want to watch the show. Please watch the show yeah. please like we said earlier six episodes it's there on Sony Live it's streaming right now so please do watch it and 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 if you enjoy it you can check out other works by Anthony Horowitz uh, Alex Rider is also there a series about a kid who becomes an MI6 spy I've yeah. never read it but uh, now that I've read Magpie Murders I'm going to definitely check out uh, oh you know there's a sequel to Magpie Murders Oh really? There is a sequel. So like uh, he wrote a sequel. Ooh. I don't know how it's going to happen, but I'm very excited to read that okay. also. Okay. That sounds like fun. I've surprisingly become an Anthony Horowitz fan and I'm not saying it just for the heck of it, but when I read the book I'm like, yaar banda sahi hai. Ye theek hai. Iske to books, iske to books padhne padenge. Correct.